Hello my viewers and today we're gonna check out how to obtain a special white podcast burrito. Let's check that out. This vehicle is only special for the enhanced version of the game. Not very long ago it was discovered that whenever you drive around burrito spawn hotspots in older versions of the game for a pretty long period of time, in my case about a good 40-50 minutes, game script sort of gets broken there and starts spawning disabled liveries as well, which is quite unfortunate to say the least. So if you are playing on PS3 or Xbox 360, do not get this fan in your save. All other players can get this fan from a mission crystal maze, which is marked on a map as a sea ladder and can be found in yellow jack in. It does not work with a mission replay. This fan is pretty easy one to get your hands on, but there are a few minor details you should bear in mind. If you work your way up to the gasoline trail part and exit the house, you can surely notice there is a white van parked outside. Those who didn't figure this yet, this is the very van we came here for. However, before you ignite the trail and use the van to escape, it is highly suggested that you pay attention to Burrito's roof layout. To change this, you can just not pour any gas and run upstairs, sit into van and drive away, fail and retry the mission. Do this as long as there is nothing on the roof of the burrito. Now remember, you don't have to do this if you don't want to, but the empty roof variant is the only one which can fit into Trevor's garage in the desert. Others do not and need different tricks to be saved into 4 car carriages in Los Santos, which is a lot more inconvenient. So I suggest getting an empty roof if you want this van and save yourself from torture with garage tricks. If you have the van you need, just go poor and ignite the gas trail and leave the area inside this van to pass the mission. White body color is not actually unique for this burrito model, however it can only spawn with McGill Olsen livery. Since this one has a fart gas livery it acts as a special combination for this van, but remember only for the enhanced version. Since some of you might still love stuff on the roof, I will explain the trick that allows storing big vehicles into interior garage quickly. For this trick, you of course need your big vehicle, a small vehicle which can enter the garage and a taxi. Try to place your vehicles the same way as shown here. The next part is complicated and requires precise timing. Press the button which activates the taxi side mission and immediately run into your small car before the dialogue ends. This trick might need being sort of familiar with what taxi dialogues sound like and turning on subtitles might help as well. Once in your small car, wait until the taxi dialogue is about to end and few microseconds before it does, press the enter garage button. If done correctly, you can exit the car after the dialogue ends, something you normally wouldn't be able to do. Right after you exit, try and run into your big vehicle as quickly as you can. If you fail, you can try this again, but I assure you, this is not an easy trick to pull off, and if you need further information, I have a video which is dedicated to that glitch specifically. This trick works with all three characters, however, it is a bit more tricky to do with Michael. For the end of this video, I would rate this vehicle easy to get. The roof equipment part can get a little tedious, but in the end, getting this vehicle is pretty easy and has a special visible color, so it's a pretty fine vehicle in my book. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, you can let me know about this by hitting a like button and of course by subscribing. Also make sure to hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my videos in the future.